Mary Underwood, see you again from Chime 96.7 at 740. Gone, gone, gone by 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. Yeah, this is, uh, this is, this is really getting real. Tomorrow's my last show here after, uh, 31 years. It's my last years. show anywhere, face it. It's my last show anywhere. <laughs> See how that tension does. <laughs> I could get a part-time gig at the LCBO, though. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, this is uh, it, it is really starting to feel very real, and I'm I'm not nervous about retirement at first. I w at, at first I was, but now I'm I'm not. I'm, I'm kind of looking forward to it. I'm kind of nervous about what's happening right now because this is this is kind of historic. What's happening here right now? My successor, after a long search, a person worthy of having Tara as a co-host. Turned out to be right under our nose all this time, Adele from the Afternoon Show. Is this really happening? This is this really happening? Is this really happening? Yes. Speaking of pinching, somebody pinch me. Is this really happening? <laughs> is this really happening? We're even videoing this. So I, it, and periscoping, too. If it's not on periscope, it's not <laughs> happening. It's on periscope. Uh, Adele started here as a teenager, as the rest of us also claim to have done. Uh, <laughs> And you're going to start by having a day off. You're going to have Canada Day off. And then you will start on the morning show Thursday morning, dark and early, 5 o'clock. Yes. 5 o'clock, yeah. Uh, Adele and Tara together are going to start the next chapter of the Chime Morning Show. Uh, we will still play today's, they will still play today's best music, news, no, traffic, weather, laughs, lots of fun. And, of course, Tara was going on holidays, but coming back. You guys will be... Uh, Together and I'm going to retire awesome. from the George and Tara show for two weeks. <laughs> for two weeks? <laughs> yeah. that yes, is awesome. and then I'm going to come back. I'm going to go on vacation and not come back. <laughs> uh, so, Adele, we invited you to come in. Thank you so much for uh, for coming in, and, and, and congratulations. And we were gentle. Like, it's not even, you know... Five o'clock in the morning. I know you should have been, you into it. You should have at least had me bring you coffee this morning. I tried, but uh, someone already did. You know, George, I'm glad you said we. Uh huh. Because you will always be here at Chime. Oh, thank you. That's, You're a that's, big that's, deal, dude. That's really nice. You're a huge deal. You're, you are... I, I'm getting nervous right now because it's kind of like a full circle thing. And I've told you this story before, but I don't know if uh, people listening right now realize how awesome you are. The reason why I think you are so successful, number one, for 31 years, is because you're a kind person. And you're a great example, and I've said it before, of how kindness can get you to the top and you can stay there. It's just easier to be kind. That's all. I was, I'm too lazy to not be kind, you know? <laughs> to be mean would take a lot of effort. But it's thank you, thank you for saying that. If you wouldn't have thought to do that, I mean, I would have never said, can I record this music for a demo so I get a job <laughs> at a radio station one day, a full-time job? You did that for me. Yeah. So for me to be sitting here right now, and as I was driving in, I passed uh, one of the high schools I attended, Eastwood. And I thought, wow, I can't believe this is happening. And you are a huge part of that. You know what? I'm glad I did that because now, 30 years later, I get to sleep in. <laughs> <laughs> Had I not done that, I'd still have to get up in the morning. So. Thank you. It's an honor. And I'm so pumped to be working with Tara. We're going to have some fun. We are going to have a lot of fun. You realize they want 31 years out of you guys. Oh, God. 31 <laughs> no years. No pressure there. No pressure at all. They'll only do this every 30 years, yeah. Hey, stick around if you can for just a few minutes, okay? For sure. All right, I got some things that I really don't need anymore, so. Might as well go to somebody who could use them. 745 Chime Traffic now. Here's Casey McDonald. Did that just happen? Today's best music, Chime Daddy 6.7, Virginia to Vegas, and don't fight the music. It's 751 with... George and Tara and Adele right now. All of us right now, yeah. Uh, in case you missed it 12 minutes ago, uh, Adele will be my successor on the Chai Morning Show. Okay, so that did happen. I'm still that trying to happen. figure out if this I is know, real. Like, I don't, I don't, do I really pinch you? <laughs> or is that just, you know. You'll be home in time for supper every day. Uh, and but you know, now you'll have to make it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Tara, for bringing that up. I know. I haven't made dinner in quite some time. Thanks right. to Dino's mom. I look forward to listening to you guys. I think it's going to be awesome. I'll be tuning in around 7.30 every morning. I'll be phoning you at 5. No, you won't. Totally. But Check listen, Adele, I got some stuff that I don't need that you can have. I have a Toronto Blue Jays schedule. Probably from 2002. The guy throws that... nothing away. No, it's actually this year's schedule. What? Yeah, the Tigers score, you'll have to look up yourself. And please give it because... Tara does this adorable little eye roll whenever you mention the Tigers. I have oh. I have sound effects. I have wait a sound effects CD. Yeah, oh yeah, That's yeah, yeah. So awesome. Sound we have effects a CD. Of what? Uh, just all kinds of things. Do we have? 
a CD player in here anymore? I don't even know. I have cassette labels. I know you may <laughs> laugh now. Vinyl came back. Perhaps cassettes will too. Hey, that's going to be worth money one day. Will you sign that? Sure. <laughs> a trivia book in case, you know, someday there is no internet. Yes. Well, you don't want this. It's a, it's a dictionary. It doesn't have a front and back cover. No, I, I, I need a dictionary. Isn't in there. <laughs> oh, you do? <laughs> <laughs> I need a dictionary. Trust me on that one. Is that I, the updated one with meh and twerk in no, it? No, it doesn't no. have meh or twerk, so no, you don't need that. <laughs> Uh, I've got a billboard book that tells you all the top hits. It stops at 2006 for some reason. Oh my goodness. But yeah, it, maybe not. And I, one other thing I have to do, I have to teach you how to burp. Huh? Tara loves it if the <laughs> person dare. sitting in this chair, just constant heard. burp. It's just like a, a, a constant rumble, is that how you yeah. described it? Yeah. Really? Yeah. No, it's disgusting. Okay, great. <laughs> well, <you> don't like <laughs> it. I don't like it. Oh, okay. I told you, like, that's the one thing I won't miss about you. Okay, so I don't have to teach you how to burp. <laughs> okay, I okay. would, uh, no. <laughs> Please. <laughs> I would, I would give you my shoes because everybody talks I about filling his shoes. I don't think it's teachable. I think it's a health issue, George, and I'm worried about you. But I have had it checked. <laughs> anyway, I'm not going to give you my shoes because uh, they're probably, you will be old trip. Size 11, right? You know what? I looked at these this morning. They were a size 45. What the heck is that? A European, I think. Maybe. At least you got good style and good taste in shoes. Well, they're, well they weren't cheap. That's why I buy a pair of shoes every year whether I need them or not. <laughs> anyway, uh, congratulations. Uh, you guys are going to be awesome together. Thank you, George. Can't Just wait. so you know, we're going to be calling you for tips on a regular basis. He's not very happy about that. <laughs> I have none. George, how do I do this? George, was, what, what do we do? See, I would just tell you to ask Tara, because that's I, what I do every day. Did you day. see? He looked at me right away like, I did. I did. I did. I don't know how to do this, Tara. <laughs> anyway, congratulations. We're looking forward to it. Thank you, George.